The Dark History of Okinoshima Island. Okinoshima Island, also known as Rabbit Island, is a small island off the coast of Japan that's home to hundreds of adorable bunnies. But what many people don't know is that the island has a dark history that's been hidden from the public for decades. During World War II, Okinoshima Island was used as a top-secret facility for the Japanese military. The island was used to produce poison gas, which was used in chemical warfare against China and other countries. Join us as we uncover the secrets of Rabbit Island and learn about the horrors of war and the resilience of nature. Okinoshima Island, commonly known as Rabbit Island, is a small island located in the inland sea of Japan. It gained popularity for its large population of friendly rabbits that roam freely across the island, attracting tourists from around the world. However, beneath its cute and cuddly exterior, Okinoshima Island holds a dark history. During World War II, Okinoshima served as a top-secret facility for the Japanese government's chemical warfare program. The island was chosen due to its remote location and natural defenses. Here, the Imperial Japanese Army secretly manufactured and tested poisonous gases, including mustard gas, tear gas, and phosgene. In 1925, the Imperial Japanese Army Institute of Science and Technology initiated a secret program to develop chemical weapons, based on extensive research that showed that chemical weapons were being produced throughout the United States and Europe. A chemical munitions plant was built on the island between 1927 and 1929 and was home to a chemical weapons facility that would go on to produce over six kilotons of mustard gas and tear gas. While Okinoshima is now known as a popular tourist destination due to its adorable rabbit population, In historical records, these are the activities carried out by the Japanese Empire during World War II on Okinoshima Island. Number 1. Chemical Weapons Production From 1929 to 1945, Okinoshima served as a secret chemical weapons production facility for the Imperial Japanese Army. The island was chosen for its remote location and was kept off official maps to maintain secrecy. The facility produced various types of chemical agents, including mustard gas and tear gas, which were used in warfare. Number 2. Secrecy and Clandestine Operations The production of chemical weapons on Okinoshima was shrouded in secrecy. Workers were sworn to secrecy and the island was heavily guarded to prevent any leaks of information. The operation was strictly controlled and access to the island was highly restricted. Number 3. Human Experimentation It is believed that human experimentation with chemical agents took place on Okinoshima during its time as a chemical weapons facility. Details about these experiments, including the extent and nature of them, are limited and often difficult to confirm due to the lack of available records. Number 4. Aftermath and Abandonment 
Following Japan's surrender in 1945, the Allies ordered the destruction of the chemical weapons and the dismantling of the facility on Okinoshima. The remaining buildings were torn down and the island was left abandoned for several years. Number 5. Memorial and Museum In 1988, a small museum, the Poison Gas Museum, was established on Okinoshima to educate visitors about the island's dark history and the horrors of chemical warfare. The museum showcases artifacts, photographs, and information related to the island's role in chemical weapons production. After the war, the chemical weapons plant was dismantled and the island was abandoned. The remaining buildings fell into disrepair and were eventually torn down. Okinoshima remained relatively unknown until its transformation into a tourist destination. Over time, rabbits were brought to Okinoshima, either by schoolchildren on a field trip or by workers who took care of the island. The rabbits multiplied rapidly due to the absence of natural predators and the island's isolation. Today, hundreds of rabbits can be seen hopping around freely, attracting tourists from Japan and around the world. Visitors to Okinoshima can enjoy interacting with the rabbits, feeding them, and exploring the island's natural beauty. The island also features a small museum, the Poison Gas Museum, which provides historical context about the island's role in chemical weapons production. As you step foot on the island, you'll be greeted by a magical sight. Adorable rabbits, ranging in size, color, and personality, roam freely across the island. They hop around, playing in the fields, and eagerly approach visitors with curiosity and affection. Visitors have the opportunity to interact with these lovable creatures, offering them snacks and gentle strokes. The island provides an immersive experience, allowing you to connect with nature and form unforgettable memories. Besides the rabbits, Okinoshima Island boasts breathtaking natural beauty. Explore the lush forests, picturesque coastlines, and serene walking trails that lead to hidden coves and stunning viewpoints. Whether you're a nature lover, a photographer, or simply seeking tranquility, Rabbit Island has something to offer everyone. As you bid farewell to Rabbit Island, you'll carry with you memories of a once-in-a-lifetime experience. The magic of this place, the connection with the rabbits, and the beauty of nature will stay etched in your heart forever. Thank you for joining us on this unforgettable journey to Rabbit Island. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more captivating travel content, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and leave a comment sharing your own travel stories and dreams.